Hey guys, Anthony here. It's Sunday, September 11th, 2022. In today's video, what I want to show is um, my current e-bike cook set setup. I did a video the other day showing you the saddlebags I put on and some of the ways I configured the back of the bike with the canteen set and in the side pouches or the panniers that I made or attached to the sides of the back basket contains these items that you see here. So I can easily pull out this flat Esbit style stove which stows in this pack because this whole thing comes apart and I have videos on this and it stacks flat and then you just put it together and then you put the center circle piece in the slots and then you could put an Esbit tablet like I have here or even a small alcohol stove or a trioxine tablet, etc. Inside here, you could add water to your canteen cup, which I did here. The only other addition that I made to this kit, and I have a video on it, is I bought one of these computer, uh, if you have a computer, a home-based computer, the little cover on the back where the fan is, you could buy these on Amazon. I just purchased one. I saw a video on it years ago. I bent down the ends and this fits on here if you had like a some type of irregular cup or something that you wanted a more solid base you could just add this so I carry this in the kit as well for this video I won't need it because the as you can see the the canteen cup fits on there pretty good so we got the Nalgene canteen I took the time to uh, cut open the the Esbit tablet just for the sake of the video um, I've got matches I've got a lighter and I've got a small baggie here with the highly recommend these bobo bars these are high calorie like food bars or meal replacer bars if you will uh, they definitely are good they fill you up you could eat half at a time whatever these are good to keep in a in a kit in a get home kit a bug out kit whatever uh, i've got in here a beverage packet with nestle hot cocoa i've got um, some japanese coffee tea bags sugar etc in here you could configure this uh, the way you like in today's video I'm just going to show you basically you know how this setup works so with the Esbit tablet one of the things you can do once you get it out of the packet you could scrape off a little uh, on it so it it adheres to a spark better if you were you know using a fire steel or you can just light the ends pick it up out of the tray light the ends and then place it in and it'll it'll just catch on it'll just catch on as you can see uh, just you just give it a little bit and then um, obviously once it catches you could put your cup on there heat your water up whatever you're gonna do for a beverage for reconstituting a meal to add ramen to uh, whatever uh, this setup like I said goes on my uh, bike that you see here I took it right out of that side pouch, the stove and the uh, beverage packet and the fire kit. And then the canteen was right there in the holder. It's right there on the uh, packet. And as you can see, the Esbit tablet's going. So what I'll do is I'll put my canteen cup here. And I think uh, this size Esbit tablet, uh, without a real windy condition, you're going to get at least 15 minute burn time. So it's going to be more than enough to heat up you know, 8, 10, 15, even 20 ounces of water. Um, here I'm just in, heating the water up uh, to make a beverage. I'm probably going to have leftover Esbit burning well after this is heated up. Uh, so today what I might do is uh, use the, uh, just use a uh, tea bag. Um, and again, I'm just going to use a Lipton tea bag and just have tea. Uh, you could put whatever you carry in your pouch, obviously, is something, things that you're used to, um, you know, drinking, things that you like. Uh, now with the, with the fall coming up and the, and the colder weather, you might want to go through your kits and add hot chocolate, whatever. Um, but just make sure you rotate this stuff out uh, and it doesn't sit long, especially your bars. Eat them and then replace them, you know, every couple of months. So go through your kits and do that. But 
the purpose of today's video to show you that on your bicycle or even your pack or a, a, a lightweight bag, you could add this stove and it will do the trick. It will do uh, what you want it to do. Uh, it's very economical to uh, purchase. And uh, let me just loosen this up and raise this up a little so you guys can see the water a little bit better. There you can see the cup already getting bubbles in the water. Again, like I said, this stove breaks down, goes right into this pouch, and the pouch goes right in your pack, or in this case on my bicycle. Um, put my knife away. And again, make yourself a, you know, a small fire kit and have redundancy, matches, cigarette lighter, fire steel, uh, etc. Some combustible things like uh, esbit tablets, trioxane, uh, even some shaved wood, uh, some kindling you can carry in a bag, uh, carry it on board if you had to get a regular fire going. Um, I like the esbit and or alcohol, like I said before. It doesn't give off smoke, so if I was lighting a fire, uh, you'd probably see smoke. And if I didn't want to give away, you know, smoke and give away my position, I could, I could um, hide this fire pretty good. And the esbit's not going to give any any sound off, per se, and any uh, smoke. And I just hide the the flame, and I'm good to go. Um, and I'm, on my bicycle, I stop in an urban area. You don't have to worry about starting a fire in an urban area. I could light the esbit on a park bench even. I've done that in Florida at a bus stop. I just went behind the bus stop. There was a little ledge there. I set up my kit right on the ledge and made myself lunch. I have that video also. Um, if I find it, I'll, I'll put it in the, um, I'll put it in the, as a link in there so you guys could see it. Um, but again, you could see that the water is in the few minutes that I've been talking, the water's getting ready to boil. Um, like I said, on my bicycle, um, I have the canteen, which is obviously right here. That's a liter. And then usually I have, if I'm going on any type of ride, I'll carry three liters on my back in a camelback type setup or um, some other type of setup similar to camelback uh, where I have three liters of water. And uh, I could use that for drinking and even use some of it to, uh, to cook with. So uh, in this video, I wanted to show those that are putting together a kit. You don't have to go to great lengths. You don't need these high-priced gas stoves uh, with the gas canisters, although those are, have their place. This is a simple setup. Very easy to put together. Make your meal or your beverage let it cool down, pack it, get it back on the road, and you're off. It's not heavy, it's light. Your canteen cup is your cook pot, can be your cup also. Um, you could eat out of it, drink out of it, dig with it, etc. Uh, it's a bomb-proof type kit, and your military-style canteen obviously is well-proven as well. The Nalgene style you could see through, but again, you don't need the Nalgene style. You can get the regular, you know, cheap style from Walmart or whatever. The Nalgene is going to cost a few dollars more, but uh, there you go. So the water for my tea is ready, and you can see that the Esbit tablet still has a lot of life uh, left in it. You can see there. So if that was, you know, 15, 16 ounces of water, that would continue to cook or continue to boil, and I'd be uh, good to go. But for the sake of this video, I just wanted to show you guys, um, you know, how to put that together and uh, make yourself a, uh, a hot beverage on the road while you're hiking or biking or trekking or camping, uh, bugging out, getting home, whatever you want to call the 